<gasps> Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Outer Wilds. I'm a little late for the stream, but no, don't ever pay attention to my scheduled screen stream times. Never, it never matters. It never matters. I can promise you. <laughs> I, I, I just start when I'm ready. Um, I should pause the game <laughs> if I'm, if I'm not touching. Um, uh, yes, hello. Um, let me send this link to a few other people as well. Um... I'm late because I was having a catch up with some friends I don't get to talk to too often. So uh that's that's that does take more importance than Outer Worlds, but hey, we're here. Hello Anthony, welcome. Um Out of curiosity, I was going to say, do you uh do you count resets as a death? <laughs> Or is that something I should, uh, um, not? Okay, I actually do, you know what? I know where I want to go first. Alright. I hope I'm far enough away that I'm not falling down. There's parts of Ember Twin I didn't explore, so I want to go back here. Is it Ember Twin that I'm thinking of? Yeah, it is. Okay. Um. Yes. Okay. Because <laughs> I was thinking it. I don't particularly feel strong about. Um. Okay, this is exactly where I want to go, and I'm about to crash. I'm fucking surprised that did not destroy my anything on this ship. Um, anyway, uh, we are going in here, because there are parts of this place that I didn't properly explore. Um, I need to remember, I need a light, thank you. The shelter should be across this way. Is it this way? Ah, oh, breathable air, okay, no. Shelters this way. Um, what did you find out? I found out a lot. Um, but uh, not exactly everything I needed to find out. Um, why does this say it's not? Uh, I I found the the uh the city underneath uh underneath uh Ember Twin. But I only explored two of the four areas that I could go to, so that doesn't help too much. i uh, walk forward until you continue to the sandfall, then it's... I'm pretty certain it was left. Need to head back here. And then it was up here. Um, hey, Curb. Then it was crossing the chasm of head, and then on the far side, it's hidden behind the fallen sand. I think I remember how to do this. And then we should be here soon. There's only a little fighter left near reach the shoulder side. You can rest there. Cool. Um, oh, fuck. Uh, that may have been the wrong choice. I don't think I was meant to go down. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, okay, cool. Here we are. 
Um, I managed to get to Ash Twin and Ember Twin, but I couldn't explore all of Ash Twin before the, um, the sun exploded. Anyway, so this is what I mean by only- so I got to this, and I turned on the lights for all of these areas. But I only explored, I think, the right two areas. The- the bottom areas, like here, um, the Anglerfush Overlook District and Stepping Stone District. I didn't go there. I did go to the- I don't know if I went to the High Energy Lab. I definitely went to the Eye Shrine District. You know. So, um, we're gonna go down to the bottom, because the sand's gonna fill up, and I wanna get there before it does. You know? The high energy lab, okay. So I wasn't able to explore here because last time the sand was too high by the time I was done with the other areas. And if I get the chance before dying in here, I want to go to Ash Twin again when it's not super high field. Okay, that's... That's annoying. Is there any way to get over here without puncturing my suit? I... no. I don't think so. Do I have to wait for this to fill up? I might. It's a scary prospect, but... Or well, maybe I came here too late. Maybe I was meant to go underneath or something. I definitely want to go in here. Okay, that's not great, but it's fine. Uh, I don't think this actually goes anywhere noteworthy. And I might die. Oh wait, no, hello. I need a rush, because otherwise... Wait, is... yes, this is going through here. Okay. Hello. I have no clue where this is. But I better explore before the sand fills up high enough for it to be a problem. Oh, that's fascinating. a cool view, I guess. Hmm, sand. I hope there's something here. Why can't I go up this way? Collision. I swear. Okay. That's clearly where I think I need to go. So that's fun. Uh, what's not fun is I don't have much oxygen left there. Oh, I take that back. Um. The hell is that sound? Is that a sand pillar? Probably. Okay, interesting. Um. The records show that... No my arriving at the top at the warp mist receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing uh, the from the Whitehall station. Ramy and I are devising an experiment to test if this is a real phenomenon or a simple machine error. In theory, what we want to try is re re what we want to try reproduce is a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering the black hole and exiting the white hole at its destination. Initial things first, our experiment setup will first pair a small black hole core with a small white hole coal to mimic the setup on the white hole station. Hypothesis, it is possible for an object to exit a white hole before entering the corresponding black hole.
An update. Our experiment here reproduced the anomaly in arrival and departure times, but Pi is unconvinced it's more than an equipment error. I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to, unaided, to the unaided eyes. To that end, we've decided to try adding more energy. I imagine the Sunless City's energy supply should prove sufficient. Um, of note, Raimi. Yari requests that we let him know before we reroute energy to the experiment. I hate to leave him in the dark. Haha, <laughs> get it? All available energy has been rerouted from the city to our experiment. Raimi and I are about to run a new test. Hypothesis confirmed. Hypothesis confirmed. I saw it. I saw it. Hypothesis confirmed. This is beyond extraordinary. This changes everything. What a beautiful day for the intersection of abstract theory and practical application. Interesting. And what do you actually have to point to do here? I don't know what that's doing. That's charging this. Oh, you know what I think I need to do? Why do I imagine that's powering something? Oh, there's another scroll. The Southern Observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is possible, that is to have something arrive 20, 22 minutes before it is actually sent before it through an app. We've learned that the negative interval of time between departure and arrival can be increased by adding more energy to the warp core. Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increase at an expense. Ex uh, problematically, uh, the, problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increases at an exponential rate. Hypothesis. Creating a 22 minute long interval is possible, but we're currently unable to generate the necessary energy. The energy is currently available, you say? You're a gas pie. My pun was unintended, Raimi, so I believe it's you in an airy form. Okay, sure. Um, Raimi and I believe it would be necessary to invent a new method of producing energy, a thrilling but enormous undertaking. We would also require an advanced warp technology headset. Oh, I see why you got annoyed that they were telling me that this was a twenty, uh, a twenty-two minute um, loop. <laughs> I, I see what you mean. I and I put I put two and two together because I someone told me it was twenty-two minutes. No, I get it. Uh, I think I would have figured that out just from the context anyway. We're getting sent back in time because of this this whole system that they've got, and they're taking the energy from the sun. I think that's what it is. So in order to stop this loop from happening, we need to stop the whatever this ash um, ash 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 twin project is that is generating the energy to send us 22 minutes back in time before the supernova because I think the energy that it is using is the sun's energy from the sun station. I think I've kind of put together what we're going to need to do to finish this game. Um, and I think this is, the, like, everything was pointing towards this anyway. But yeah, I, I get it. I get it. 22 minutes, that makes sense. <laughs> it's from the supernova. The supernova is what generates enough energy. Um, and they use the sun station to send us back in time. You know? We would also likely need an enormous space to fit these proposed new energy and warp technologies together. The only location large enough would be Ash Twin, and that's where the Ash Twin project is. There's no more solution, Romance's son. <laughs> Ignore the yup. Yeah. I think the yup was about the 22 minutes thing and people telling me how long the loop was, but that's good to know. I mean... If I didn't, if no one told me, I would have just looked at my stream time to try figure it out. <laughs> the Ash Twin project will be one of our biggest undertakings, metaphorically and physically. To build it, we will, yeah, the Ash Twin. We will need 
a way to travel quickly between Ash Twin and each location that holds crucial project materials. What if we used warp towers like the one we have in Whitehall Station to connect Ash Twin directly to each critical location? Poke, Root and I can begin work on this immediately in the Black Hole Forge. This will keep us busy. Of note, each tower on Ash Twin will warp to a different planet. We can de design each tower to visually reflect its warp de destination. The Giant's Deep Tower, for instance, could resemble a cyclone, and we could model the Timber Half Tower after a geyser mountain. That one's fascinating. My gratitude to those who noticed noted my imprecise language. Yes, the sun is not a planet. I believe this is sufficiently clarified. Kindly stop reminding me. Giant's Deep Tower. I don't know if we've encountered the tower, but a geyser mountain. I've definitely been finding stuff underneath somewhere regarding that. Okay. This door will remain closed for some time, Pan. Our gun experiment based on the experiment from my host station. A uh, high energy lab is now being used to design the Ashtrain project. If you're here to help or even just observe, you'll be sure to use the Sunless part City Path to the lab. Uh, this is if I found this place on the other side. Yeah, Remy and I will be running this experiment until one of us, specifically me, can prove the other wrong. So, although it's inconvenient, the lab currently can only be accessed by the path from the Sunless City. Yeah, which I've already, yeah. Inviting the sand inside would disrupt our setup and could have enormous consequences. We realize this is an intriguing prospect that remain door must remain closed nonetheless. The Sunless City, yeah. While I'm here, I do want to see what's on top of here. I don't think there's anything particular of note. I don't imagine there is, but... Oh, there's actually a... Oh, that's interesting. This is probably where we saw what we saw on the other side of... Uh, when we used the Ash Twin projection on one of those things earlier. Um, I hope I haven't just gotten lost. Wait, where the fuck was I five seconds ago? It was around here. Okay, cool. Holy shit. Um, I'm going inside, thank you. I don't see any projection slabs. I can't imagine what these mean. I also don't know what I'm looking at from here. Oh, am I outside? I must need to go there from the other side is what they probably want me to do. I'm gonna move this back to charge the thing. There's more to explore here. Might send something like that when, yeah, you're missing something. I appreciate that. Like, more to explore inside the place, or... I'm assuming I want to jump down where the scout is. But I should be careful, I'm running out of fuel, hey. Uh, I don't think I can jump down where the scout is, hey. Unless it's like right here or something. Yeah, goddamn, I don't know what's going on here. Um, energy lab. Oh, hello. What did that just do? Oh, I think I closed the door. 
<laughs> Oops. Um. Yeah, I will look around very carefully. Oh, interesting. Oh, these are black and white warp cores. Interesting. Ah, I gotcha. I see. Oh. Okay, what about two white holes? That doesn't do anything. does come out ahead. And then two black holes? I don't think this works. I don't think this does anything. What about the ones with nothing in them? I think I need a black and white hole, hole to work, work this. What happens if I swap that while you're like this? That's really fucking weird to look at, by the way. I'm not getting anything particular on my... I don't mind if I run out of time here, because I'm still trying to figure out what this place is all about. This charges down... Uh, also the sand's rising a bit too far. Also interestingly, that's still there regardless of whether it's charged or not. I don't know what this is meant to be doing. Fun with holes. Hi, Marcus. Generator is now going this way. I don't know what... Oh, uh... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I did notice what happened. It came out earlier on the other side. Also, frame drops. Great stuff. It didn't update in the ship log, so I'm not certain that's anything useful for me at the moment. There's still another area in this city that I haven't explored that I'll have to do at some point. But, for now, I'm happy with that. I'm gonna see if I can get to my ship. Because I'd like to explore Ash Twin.
There's still more to explore in Ash Twin that I haven't done. It was different depending on how much power you're supplying from the lab. Oh, I didn't notice that. Um, also, hello, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, god. Um, oh, yeah, that, that, that's gonna happen. Okay. Great. Great to know. Oops. Yeah, I should wait till the sand finishes, but cool. Great. Oh, interesting. I can only see sand. It's There's nothing. Okay, that's funny. You gotta stop helping. <laughs> well, I did it. Did it. Is that something I needed to have added to my ship log? Because I don't think that added anything to my ship log. So what the hell is here? Have I been here? Oh, we're getting sent up again. Fun. It immediately happens, yeah. I don't know if I've ever been in this area. No, I have. I couldn't get down. That's the, the problem. This is a black hole generator. Oh, I know what- I've seen these things around, so I understand what they are now. Also, hi, son. That's a black hole generator. What's over here? Ow. Shit, wait. Is this what I was reading last time? I think it was. This is why I, I didn't read D in detail. Because the time was moving too fast for it. Well, dude, I don't know how to explore those two planets, but, um, Take so much self control. Maybe I should. Maybe I should give mod to someone else. Demoted from mod. Nah. <laughs> You're good. Adolfo. That's the first time I've died in a cactus room. Okay. Before we do anything, what have we updated? Designs for each... Oh, I see. Designs for each of the towers on Ash Twins Equator. Each tower warps to a different planet, although many Nomai were quick to note that the sun is not actually a planet. Um, the towers allowed the Nomai to quickly travel between Ash Twin and all locations crucial to the Ash Twin project. The central chamber inside the Ash Twin was physically sealed off by an immensely thick protective shell. Um... 
The Nomai plan to construct the technology capable of producing a 22 minute negative time interval in Ash Twin. Yes. <laughs> okay. The Sulsa Black Hole Forge. Nomai crafted warp cores at the Black Hole Forge before delivering them to the Ash Twin. I don't know where that is. Sunless City. There's, yeah, there's still more to explore in the Sunless City. Um, the Sun Station. The Nomai built a Sun Station in order to power the Ash Twin project. The Nomai built something called the Sun Station, but not everyone supported its construction. Okay. There's still a lot more I'm not super, you know, old settlement. There's still more to do there. Okay. I reckon I go back to the Sunless City. Statue Island is Gabbro. Yeah, I still haven't explored a lot of things. <laughs> now, don't start a war in the comments, please. Alright. <laughs> I'm going back to the Sunless City because there's still more to explore there that I haven't gone through. And I think. I can't find the sun because it's over there. There we go. I wonder if that thing is related to all of this. That thing there probably is, hey. Dark Bramble seems very unrelated to all this. I wonder how it's all going to tie together. Turn off the game. I'm going to crash into fucking... No, no, stop. Stop. You're going to make me crash into the fucking other planet. Uh, okay. I'm going to crash into the other planet again. Okay. No, we're fine. It's so funny seeing Ash Twin with this much sand. I'm not used to it. Okay. There we go. Yep, I had a feeling that was going to happen, but that's okay. We'll manage. Fuck me. Did I really do that? Okay. Let's head back. The one thing I wish this game had was like... Not necessarily fast travel, but ways to get back to places that you've already been to very quickly. Oh, right. That's the wrong way. Because doing this every single time I want to get here is kind of annoying. But I get it. It's also not a huge deal because these loops don't take too long. You know. Like, I get it. I know the path now anyway, so it's not a huge deal. I bought the DLC, yeah, I just haven't installed it. Because that's what's been suggested. Okay. There's a big ass area. Give me some oxygen, thank you. Okay. So, I've done. The, I have not checked the stepping stone. I've checked these two. So I can deactivate these. I'm gonna activate them again. Okay. But, that's the area at the bottom. Okay, so still other areas I really could check. Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's turn these off. Just so I don't get too confused about what I'm missing. Okay. So there's stuff over here I haven't quite checked out. Okay, okay. Whew. That was scary, but okay. Damn, bro. 
You died while sleeping, what the fuck? Are those massage chairs or something? I don't know. We're meeting in the fo fossil fish cave to play the game. If you're too big to climb through to the uh, anglerfish overlook hole, you have to go the long way, but it isn't far. Go to Stepping Stone Cave, then up into Fossil Fish Cave. Uh... I tried to get to the fossil through... Uh, to the fossil fish through the Stepping Stone Cave, but I couldn't find the entrance. Where is it? Ta uh, Taggett can't fit through the anglerfish out look hole anymore because he grew bigger. He's taller than Levy now. These are kids. Who cares? I like to steal the tallest. I remember to feed the fossil fish first. If you go to the anglefish overlook you throw and throw a line to his mouth, he'll show you the way. Throw a light into his mouth. So hello. What's up here? Are we playing the fossil fish game tonight? I fed the fossil fish in New Lantern. If you go to Stepping Stone Cave, the entrance to Fossil Fish Cave is easy to see now. Gratitude, Solanum. It's good <laughs> that you're small enough to climb through the hole at Anglefish Outlook. I'm still small enough. You won't be for long. Mum Dad are tall, so you and I will be tall too. I'm guessing this is basically hinting that, especially with the Anglerfish in Dark Bramble, I'm supposed to send a scout to it? Because that provides a light source and then it will be friendly. Is my guess? That's the only thing I can guess based on this context. And I think that's what it's trying to tell me to do. Okay, this door's broken. Otherwise, there should be other stuff I can explore here. Uh, these are just stairs to get down. Okay. Is this the cave that they were talking about? Stepping Stone Cave. I need to be fast because I think... I'm going to run out of time to explore what I want to explore. Oh, I'm just back here. Okay. I don't like this music, by the way. It's too creepy for me. As in, that, that, that's a compliment for the music. It's, like, really good. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going, frankly, but like... God, it'll be fine. I think that just takes me back down. Yeah, let's go up the stairs. Whatever. Okay. Unless this is the fucking lab that was just in, which I don't think it is, but... No, this is a different area. Oh no, I'm back here, what the fuck? Hold on. Was this area? St I just closed the door. Fuck, no, that's not what I meant to do. Stepping stone cave. Hold on. What it said in here was you have to go to the step, uh, then into the fossil fish cave. I think the sand might have filled up too high. Oh, no, actually, maybe it's over here or something. It does look like there's something down here. I don't know, to be honest. You know what? It's fine. I have no clue what's going on here. There's still more to explore elsewhere, so it's fine. I think. Yeah, there's... Thank you for the oxygen. I need fuel, though. Okay. Fuck, I don't know where this is. Anglerfish Fossil Outlook.
This is amazing. Look inside the cave. How did this come to rest here? We haven't encountered others in these caves. I think it's a rare find. An update. We need to find a way inside quickly. Melaray, because when I returned here to search for an entrance to the cave, there were children playing on the specimen. From what we can see, Coleus and I believe the specimen must be very old and thin. Imagine what we might learn if we could examine it. We both agree it's unlikely this dry planet uh, is this uh, horror's place of origin, especially considering what we observed in the vessel's evacuation. Clearly, this hole's too small for it to... Uh, uh, fit th to have a hole for it to fit through. There's another entrance to this game. If there is, Coley Sign will find it. Oh, it's Doc Ramble. That's fucking creepy as shit. It's gotta be Doc Ramble. There's gotta be a seed somewhere. There's something up there. Oh no, there is another entrance to the cave from above. I'm gonna die from the sand, by the way. I'm so ready to die. hauntingly beautiful. Ooh, hello? How do I get in there? How do I get in there? There's dialogue in there to check. Probably up through here then. I see. I'm supposed to choose the right... Right one. Where the fuck am I? Where the fuck is the thing? Okay. So if I went up, and the first thing I went down was wrong, it must be the one behind it. Like, over here behind it. Yeah, perfect. Who's been- who's been computing shuttle trajectories to the sun station? Oh, that makes it moves again. Who's been computing shuttle trajectories to the sun station? Don't worry, the station is in such a low stellar orbit, we've constructed a different, safer way to travel there from Ash Twin. That would be Pi. I told her that we wouldn't be traveling there by shuttle, and that the sun station doesn't even have a landing pad, but she said she knew the sun station. Shuttle trajectories to the sun station. Pure theoretical exercise on my part, Yarrow, who doesn't love computing a good low stellar orbit. <laughs> Shuttle trajectory. Oh, that's the thing that's orbiting around the sun at the moment. I, Pi, I look forward to working with you, but I'm also relieved it'll be easier to return to Ash Twin regularly. A safer way to travel there from Ash Twin. Oh, so that's how I get to the thing. But that's... But I can't get to Ash Twin without... it. The sun explicitly already absorbing it all. I don't think there's anything else here. What can I say? I'm... I'm... Smart. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, that, that, that sounds so bad. Um, well, I think that's it in regards to what I was looking for uh, in this area. Is there anything else I can do? I think I've explored everything except for figuring out a way to the, the anglerfish. Uh, which, there must be a way. It's just, I don't know it. Uh, I'm gonna try going back up, because I don't think I actually explored that up, upper area. 
properly. Maybe I did. Maybe there actually isn't anything here, but... Yeah, okay. Oh, fuck. <laughs> That's good to know. Uh, I'm ready to die. But I'd love to get back to my... My ship, because I think... It would be cool to... Okay. Give me odd oxygen. Is this way I won't die? But I also don't really have a way out of here. Ice Shrine District, Stepping Stone District. I'm... Pretty sure we're gonna die. But... Let's try the Ice Shrine District. I'm... Falling down. That was fucking awesome. I'm not gonna lie. I think I aimed that fucking amazingly. What's in here? Probably death below. So I'm not gonna attempt that. That's death below, also. This is the way I get out of the planet. Out into the planet, I should say. And then figure out how to get to my ship without any fuel. Holy shit. It's on the other side of the planet. Great. I think we... Don't bother with this... Oh wait, no, I think we'll be okay. Yeah, we're good. We'll get there. The sun is not a planet. No, it's a star. Actually, now that you said that, now I'm wondering if it's actually going to be important to keep that distinction in mind for some reason. Alright. Thank you. Up we go to the Ash Twin. I don't know what I can do here, still. I don't know if there is anything I can do here, just yet. Have I been here? must have been here last minute. Yeah, here's the black hole generator. Uh, that's gonna hit me. So I'm gonna like... I know the ship's gonna get hit. But, like, it's fine. That's fine. This is fine. Found it. Okay. Let me get down to where I can read this. Okay, time to stop moving. Uh, friends visiting from the Hanging City. We're planning the Ash Twin project at a high at the high energy lad on Ember Twins Equator. I became lost on Ember Twin, my gratitude that Raimi found me, but the high energy lab is the building with the large solar panels. I'm surprised I didn't see it. <laughs> Imagine how otherwise immensely clever Connor would lose his own head if it weren't anatomically impossible. Anima a 
anatomically impossible. Is there anything else in here that I could pick up off the shelves? No. It's a very fascinating area that I don't think has done me much good. I do want to spend my time on these areas though because I need to figure out what to do on this planet. It's all black holes. All black holes. Does it mean the center of Ash Twin is a black hole? That's fascinating. I think I've done this loop before and I didn't have too much luck figuring out what I- OH! Am I somewhere new? I'm somewhere new. I'm somewhere new. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. I shouldn't have jumped. Where the fuck am I? What the fuck was that? Was that the fucking moon? Was that the fucking hollow moon? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Yo. Wait, that's... Holy shit. 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 This should take me to... Takes me back to hollow, uh, hollow, brittle hollow. <sighs> okay, okay. It's annoying. But I'm quite literally going to need to, like, come back another time. Yeah, I see myself transported. Okay. Yeah, this is where I thought I was. But it wasn't. Wait, a time. Oh, I arrive a point a millisecond ahead. Like, a thousandth of a millisecond. That's... Oh, I see, I see, I see. Everything is fucking hinting at shit. Okay. Well, there's not really much I can do now that I'm in this position, unfortunately. Unless I can launch myself into orbit fast enough that I can, like, exit orbit. Why can I... Oh, that's just Brittle Hollow. And even then, I don't think there's any guarantee I'm getting to the place I want to go. Oh, no, actually we're out. We're out of orbit. The gravity is small enough, so... Let's head towards the... No, no, it's pulling back in. Alright. Oh. Uh, sure. I thought the gravity would be weak enough that it wouldn't matter. Are we going back to the black hole? I guess we might be. Uh, I'm dead. Dead body goes into the black hole, baby. How did I keep my head on straight after that? Um... <laughs> because I'm used to going to the white hole station at this point, I guess. When you're playing with black holes, there's a certain expectation I have. I don't know. That's fascinating. How do I do that again? Is kind of what went through my head. Because I realized I fucked up 
pretty quickly. I'm gonna try get there. I have to wait till enough sand is gone. That's the problem. That's a funny update. There's a way to the sun station from the Ash Twin. That might have been what I found. I think it's because I'm starting to figure out... <laughs> so much happened in the span of 10 seconds, yeah. I think I'm starting to figure out what I should be looking at. Like, like, I'm starting to figure out, I, like, understand the plot of this game a little better. And why we're looping like this. Uh, uh, there's just not much I can do at Ash Twin right now. D oh god, I don't have my fucking spacesuit on either. That doesn't help. <laughs> Bro. That would help. Okay, hold on. You should log. Um, there's way more to explore there, yeah. In Brittle Hollow's Hanging City. I want to see if I can get there. But... <sighs> God, there's so much to do in this game. I'm still feeling overwhelmed, actually. Um... I want to focus on the Ash Twin stuff, but the problem is waiting. So I, I, I'm wondering what the best thing... I might have accidentally wound up on the Quantum Moon, honestly. I wish I checked. But... That also could have just been the Sun Station. Regardless, maybe I track the... There's a Quantum Signal coming from the Hourglass Twins. Well, we're here. Maybe we should check chat as well. Chat. Quantum fluctuations. It's actually coming from here. Well, that's fascinating. Where here? Shit me. I've never been to the core of this area. That's weird. What the fuck? Where the hell am I? Okay, you know what? I'm getting out. This ship's gonna fucking... Uh... Maybe not. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Can I get out of here, please? Oh my god. It's actually coming from in here. Where? Where is this coming from? Up here. Okay. I don't think being in the center here is going to help me find what I'm looking for here. Am I not fucking... How the fuck do I get out of here? Oh, hold up. Hello, What? what is this? I don't think I can land my ship here. I didn't realize there's this whole area in the center of Ember Twin that I haven't explored because the sand every time I get here seems to have filled it up. The way for this. Okay. Well, that's very fascinating. I don't know, frankly, what I'm doing. Uh, I'm guessing there's nothing here, so I'm going to go the other way. Hello? 
Where am I? What is here? What have I found? Where is this quantum? It's like on the same level as me. So I'm in the right area for this quantum fluctuation, I think. Okay. I don't see anything here, so I better hurry up, hey. First of all, is there anything up here? Oh, hello, I found it. Cave shard. Okay, uh, Coleus is missing. He vanished from Lakebed Cave, the one at the bottom of this dry... of the dry lake bed at the North, North Pole, several days ago, and were unable to find any trace of him. I don't know how much air he had when he disappeared. I beg any friend reader reading this, help us dis discover Coleus. This rock is very familiar. Did you travel here, my sedimentary friend? With unique color and texture, is identical to a rock I met earlier. Wasn't this the same rock fragment in the cave we found at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole? An update, Melaray and I went back to the lake bed cave and observed this rock again. Sometimes it's there, sometimes it isn't. This means that this rock wanders like the quantum moon does. How curious. We plan to re-examine the northern lake bed cave. I didn't realize there's a la northern lake bed cave. Oh fucking hell. You fucking piece of shit. The cactus spawned on me. That's awesome. Oh, uh, there was nothing down there. Great to know. Okay, so there's a lake bed cave at the north of this entire place. Okay. Oh, he's up there. Okay. I'm gonna... Okay, wait, there's stairs here. Where did this lead? Oh, this is the North Pole. Oh, well, found it. Okay. Well. Maybe I need to come back here quicker in future because this seems like it's just leading me out to a safer place yeah okay I think the lake bed cave is something I need to come back here to begin with is that where I came from it might be Yes, it is. Okay. You were, you were cleaning your keyboard? Sure. It's totally what it was. Alright. I'm gonna jump down. I don't think there's anything noteworthy here, but... What's the harm? Yeah, I see. Let's head to Ash Twin. If I can not die in the process of going there, that'd be great. I guess while we're here, we can, like, check on whoever... Shirt, was it? Was it its fucking name? Also, fuck me. I can't do this. Three minutes of oxygen remaining. Fucking lovely. Fuel level critical. Even better. Ah, oh, that's fine. I can refuel in everything yeah hello uh, I found something no my writing about the Sun station is is that what's an orbit around the Sun do you think the Sun station the Sun station quite clever no to devise a way to study Sun up close and personal must be tremendously difficult to construct and hot inside I can only imagine I wonder how they were able to travel back and forth from the Sun station and the hourglass wind when the slightest of would have met to fiery death well I know because they had fucking teleportation where is my ship We'll be fine. 
Momentum, baby. Ow. That's not what I call being fine, but it's it's fine. Can I get back into my ship? Wait. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Oh god. <laughs> I hope I can find a way to get back in. Okay, cool. Up we go. We're going to Ash Twin. It's still a little early, actually. I wonder how much time it's going to take. Probably not too much. I reckon we can wait. Wait it out. Was this the one? No, this is the place I think I was looking at. If I recall correctly. Uh, this is going to be bad for my ship. But it's fine. I'm pretty sure this is... No, this is not the place. Oh god, ship. Let me get back to the ship. Because I don't want to have to deal with this. Okay. Just slightly out of the way. Okay, these areas are starting to open up now, so that's good. I just gotta be careful of the, the piling bit of sand that's gonna lift us up to the other planet. Um, I need to figure out which one was the fucking... Okay, away. That's fucking dragging us up. It's annoying. Okay. Strong winds here tonight. Fun. Alright. Hey, no, 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 no. Fucking hate this. Let me just, let me... <sighs> Fuck this shit. Okay, you know what? We got it. It's fine. I'm not using the ship anymore anyway. So I can't go there. This is where we were. This black hole thing doesn't do anything. But they all generate a black hole somewhere else, I think. And I think I'm on my way to finding that. This is it. This should be it. I think. This was the room, wasn't it? I'm not entirely sure how it activated. Was it a specific time when it activated? Oh no, I need to give it energy, don't I? Oh wait, no, is this the place? Oh, it must be when I fucking face it. Oh, this is a warp platform, like the previous area. Oh, oh god. Oh god, what? Here's our first discovery. One warp fresh from the Black Hole Forge. Root is installing this core sibling on the Brittle Hollow as I write this. Brittle Hollow. Ah, I see. My gratitude, Clary. With this, the Ash Twin Project is underway. I confess, I'm deeply curious about what Poke found on the Whitehall Station that started this project. Could I visit sometime to learn more? I recommend the Whitehall Station is the model um, for the towers being built. The Whitehall Station is the model for the towers being built in the Ashwin Project. I see, I see, you know, I figured it out. Uh, so a visit to the second will be doubly useful. I suppose, more precisely, I would like to visit with you, Clary. <laughs> Yarrow, stop using the scroll to flirt with my assistant. Romantic matters are density rather than... Oh, wait, no, I've already read this. I remember reading this. Um, I wish... Yeah, yeah, an unfinished work. Okay, no, no, no. I see. This entire thing is quite literally... We need to wait till... The Hollow Moon's... Yeah, here we go. No? Do we need to activate... Do I need to activate the energy in here? I must. 
out. These are all towers pointing somewhere. These are all warp panels that will teleport me somewhere. I just happen to be in the right one at the right time. I think that's what happened last time. Yeah, okay. Why is it saying launch shoot? Launch scout. Interesting. Can I launch scout into there? Oh, I can. Aha. Uh -huh. That's interesting. I don't know how to get in here. Is this door open or closed? It's locked. Okay. I see. No, no, I see. These are all towers that transport to each area. I gotcha. Um, also, I, you know, light would be very helpful right now. I wonder if the scroll powers anything. I wasn't paying attention to see for sure, but it might. I don't think it does. Okay. I understand what they want us to do. This is where I went. Also, fuck. Let's not die. This is where I teleported last time, right? This is one of these teleportation things. Yep, here we go. Where are we? Where did it teleport us to? We are now on Timber Half. Okay. I see. So that one teleported us to Timber Half. Okay. Arrival time, a split second charge. Uh, step onto warp receiver platform to activate and return warp. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, I see. So I should be able to go here, and this will take me back. Wonderful. Okay. Uh, that's not the way I want to go. Okay, this is going to suck. I gotta sit and wait and see where these take me. Because it's not entirely clear if these take me anywhere. Okay. <laughs> okay. One of these take me to the place I want to go, and I don't know which one it is. Is this going to be the sun station, maybe? Hmm. That's Brittle Hollow. Is this fucking... No, it's not taking me anywhere. This is Giant's Deep. Okay. This one I'm not certain does much. I think I've seen everything that it could potentially transport me to. I need to see how to get back to the, the other area that we saw earlier.
This one seems broken, actually. the one I accidentally find my way into actually. I don't think it is but I don't know how to find my way into it. How do I stumble my way in here? Oh. There's a path here. Can I get it? This is... I wonder if I can... Ah. Uh, I reckon I'm supposed to go very... This is where I died. Yeah. I need to be very fucking careful here. I'm dead. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay. I have to make it through the cactus room. I have to fucking make it through the cactus room. I understand how that works. I gotcha. So, I actually wonder if that warp warps me to any planet it passes through. It did not go to the hollow moon. the one next to it. Oh, is this the hollow moon? Probably fucking is. Yeah. Oh, I'm about to die again. Gone in 60 seconds! <laughs> Can always come back to the cactus later. Yeah, I might. What was that trophy? I need to see that. Where was it? Uh, they're all fucking hidden. That's fantastic. Um, end a time loop alive after taking and healed over a thousand damage. Okay. Dude, I, I gotta be honest, when I'm playing this game, I, I feel like I'm never gonna finish it. I know there's an end, but it feels like every time I make progress, there's like five other objectives that pop up. And it's scary. It fucking, it, it's fucking scary, man. Oh fuck. I'm surprised that took no damage. I didn't realize I was still in the atmosphere. Let's get out. And then we can do this. What I wanted to do was check the ship log, quantum caves, and this leads to the lake bed cave. I still haven't checked the lake, lake bed cave. Let's do that. Hopefully I haven't left too much time to get there. Because the problem with the lake bed cave is I need to get there and also like... Okay. I see the north pole. We're good. I know where I need to go. I see it. 
Okay. I'm gonna crash. How do I not take damage? Oh, landing is is damage. Never mind. I think that was it. Anyway. Lake Bed Cave is, I believe, what I was supposed to do. Uh, fucking... Okay. This must be it. Having a bit of light helps. It's a dead end, that's annoying. That's exiting. I think the sand's about to kill me. Also a dead end. Is it a dead end everywhere? Must not be, right? There's got to be something here, yeah. Okay, cool. Be nice to be able to see. What the hell are these? Oh, hello. I see. Did this fucking disappear when I stopped looking at it? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's this fucking kind of cave. There's no shot. This is actually kind of fucking raw, I gotta be honest. Yeah, I turned that off. Yeah, I think the scout was stopping me from being able to do that. That's cool as shit. Hello, oxygen. If you've come here to look for Coleus, this is where he was, where we were when he vanished. He's been missing for two days now. But what happened before Coleus disappeared? We're examining the different rocks. I recall Coleus standing on the largest one, the Wandering Rock. T I I was taking notes, and then my lantern died. When I lit it again, Coleus and the rock were both gone. You're strange. Causing wandering rock friend uh, is here, though Coleus isn't. Coleus and I observed this unusual-looking rock shard and several small rocks. At least two other caverns. I'm sure this is relevant. He said... Was standing on the largest rock, and then he disappeared. Cave shard. I wonder what this does. Ah, I gotcha. <sighs> now the rock's gone. Oh, this is moving as well. That's so fucking... Creepy as shit. Ok, 
Okay. I think I figured out what I'm supposed to do here. Hello? Friends, if you find any sign of Coleus, I implore you to tell him. Vanish without a trace during a research ship. Where was Coleus log? We disembarked the dry lake bed. I turned away from Coleus to examine some of them. Turned back, he simply wasn't there anymore. He had lifted an air supply. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Aha. 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 Now I'm in a totally different area. How curious. This rock took me with it to a new location. I wonder why this happened. Curious but also alarming. This new cave appears to lack an entrance or exit. Also, the rock that brought me here disappeared while I wasn't watching. The wandering rock has returned. Never before I've been so delightfully seen a sedimentary specimen. I wonder if myself became quantum briefly when the rock carried me here. This seems the clearest explanation. Hypothesis. If the rock can bring me here, it can also carry me out. My hypothesis is correct. I can travel on this rock as long as I'm not observing my surroundings. I mean, it must be in complete darkness. I'm going to bring my mentor here to see this. Melloray is here t t now too. We theorize when a conscious being is in contact with a quantum object and ceases to act as an observer, explaining the need for darkness. The being can become entangled with that quantum object and they move together. Friends, Coleus has discovered a new quantum rule. He almost promised. He also pres has also promised me he'll never vanish again, if even if he does learn something useful from it. Okay, well, that's interesting. That's really interesting. Um, now I'm back here. Yo, that's cool as shit. Where am I now? Is this a new area? Have I been here before? Oh, I have. I think this is the area I was in the first time when I came. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. That's really cool. Quite literally a light off moment, not light bulb. Okay. I think that's the end of that particular thing because it seemed to be swapping between three locations. But that does make sense for future places to look. Uh, let's uh, first like heal up. <laughs> okay. I don't think there's anything more to explore here. Conscious being is non-contact, which means I need to not be looking at the quantum moon to actually land on it, I think. I wonder if that just means when I'm heading in the direction of it, I turn around. I still don't know how to deal with the, the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. That's interesting. But... Hmm. Okay. I, I, I see where this is going. It's gonna give me the the i like the the knowledge behind how to get there. Maybe I should do the one in Giant's Deep now. I don't think the ash has enough sand off it for it to do anything significant useful significantly useful. Okay. Was that the fucking quantum moon? Oh god. Yo, we got all of them. Also, the sun's fucking dragging me in. Why is the sun dragging me in? I'm not that close to it. It is dragging me in, damn. Let's get away. And you find the one at the giant's deep, which I actually don't see on the fucking anywhere. Is it behind the sun? It's gotta be.
the quantum fluctuation from that area, funnily enough. All right, hold on. I'm getting way too far out, and I just need to go to Giant Steep, which is on the other fucking side of the sun. Yay! I still need to figure out how to transport myself over to the sun station as well. well that's actually not helpful, because uh, I'm seriously going in the direction I'm not wanting to go. I'm scared of Giant Steep. I really am. It's on the other side of the sun. Nothing bad has ever happened with autopilot. Yo, is that an eclipse? Is that an eclipse effect? I don't think so. I think it's just glowing for some reason. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, it is just glowing. Okay. No, ignore me. Okay. <laughs> oh, I see it. Wait, hold on. Maybe avoid... Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Did the moon disappear? I think it fucking disappeared. Damn it. Alright. Giant sleep again. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> Just land on the sun station, easy. Yeah, absolutely. We're gonna crash into the fucking debris from this cannon. No, I think it's smart enough not to do that. I was looking for the quantum fluctuations, so it's fine. Problem with going in here is you can't see how close, okay. Alright, it's mostly ocean, so it's fine. Yeah, I see jellyfish, so that's nice. Um, oh, hello, I can get in underneath here. I think. No? There's a tower inside the cyclone. And it keeps blowing me away. Okay. I don't think there's any way to get inside this cyclone. Unless I can approach it from on top. Which also seems kind of unlikely. I can't see fucking anything, holy shit. Okay. What if I just go directly into it? Oh! Okay, I guess that is how I do it. Well, the ship's gone. I don't know if I'm getting my ship back, but that's fine. You know what? We're here. It is up here somewhere. Okay. Cool. The ship was meant to land here, but unfortunate. I actually don't know what it expects me to do here. 
other than no there's too much gravity here it's too big of a planet Does buoyancy make up anything? Like, if I go down, will it fucking thrust me up? I don't think so. That didn't work out at all, but okay. Jump scare, holy shit. This is not how I did it, but skill. Yeah, it makes sense. Um, shit. Now I'm afraid I'm gonna fucking miss something that is like really important. It's great that there's trees here, but. I feel like not coming here the normal way is like causing problems for me because I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Okay, whatever's up here. I can make this. Surely. No, okay. Am I, am I gonna fucking. I'm gonna soft block myself, I swear. Not that you can really get soft block because the timer will kill you anyway. Um, or you can just reset the loop, but that, that, it's fine. You get what I mean. I can't imagine there's anything... Maybe there is something underneath here that I'm supposed to look. Jellyfish! I see the core. What the fuck is the core? Why does the core look like that? Okay, Grove Shard. I'm just trying to think, were there any other quantum areas I could access which had complete darkness? I don't think so. Frame drops, by the way. Okay. Yeah, holy shit. Holy frame drops. <laughs> okay. I don't think there was anything actually useful going around this perimeter like that. Um... Just a waste of fucking energy. I wonder if I'm supposed to use my ship to get up, actually. Oh, wait, I'm fucking blind. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you serious? Michael, holy shit. I hope... Fuck. The sun's about to start fucking screaming at me. Yeah, it's probably the storm. Be welcome to this place. The tower shares all who asked for the quantum journey. Oh, this is the tower of... Fascinating. Enter this place without your friends, however. These are lessons to learn for yourself. Okay. Yo, that's cool. Seek the Wandering Arch. I see. Two times gravity does not help here. That's what I'm looking for. Um, it's probably just going down, hey. I better hurry up. 
observing a quantum object, observing an image of a quantum object, these are the same. That's what's scaring me, the sun. We have to come back here. Fuck. I'm not getting through this, this is so annoying. Shit sucks. No. Observing is the same as observing an image. Oh, right. Right. Ah, oh, fuck. I noticed this with the last one. Okay, I wonder if I can get through here. Fuck me. So annoying. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay. I'm dying because of the sun. I don't have time to get through. I'm right at the end too! This is the last one, but we made it harder. No! I'm dead. I'm out of time. Yeah. Alright. We'll try this again. We're going back there. If I can land there, that would be awesome. <laughs> Oh, fuck. I'm so annoyed that was interrupted. I started figuring it out. Okay, okay. Interesting that there's a quantum tower there as well. Okay. We're rushing to Giant Deep. It's right above us. We need to go there now. I did figure it out. Yeah, I'm going straight back. <laughs> the problem is landing there. That's the issue I have. You know. There we go. I think it's on the other side of the island I am at of the the planet I think Okay I need to line myself perfectly with this Uh I'm going to take the plunge I was slightly off damn it It's in here Okay There we go. That's a much smoother way of getting in here. Holy shit.
<laughs> Let, let's do this properly this time. <laughs> Hold up. I need some water. Let me get a sip. Anyway, hey, Junaid. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this game's a bit too absorbing for me to... Like, I, I feel like I read the chat and then I don't respond because I'm so absorbed in this game, which is a good thing about the game. It's also, I'm being cautious with reading chat too often. Um, because if someone does say something that, like, I've noticed uh, Henry's, like, retracted a bunch of messages. Um, deleted a bunch of messages uh, of his own, actually, because um, I think he said too much and he realized after he said it. So I'm just, I'm like, I'm, I'm reading chat, just not super, super frequently. Hold up. Let's make this much fucking easier for me for myself. <laughs> Don't you agree? <laughs> Hi myself. I think what I need is specifically... Oh, I see. Um... Okay. There we go. I got very lucky last time with this. Fucking hell, you can take damage from that? Holy shit. Wait, did I count the death? Did I forget to count the death? No, I did count it. Okay, we're good. <laughs> this is the last one, isn't it? We're back here. But we made it harder. Okay. Well, that's nice. Um... Okay. Uh, I see what I'm supposed to do here. Until it's like that, yeah. Gotcha. And then it's about finding the arch, which... Uh, that works. Okay. I think we made it. 
We offer our congratulations. You've learnt the rule quantum quantum imaging. Take this knowledge with you to, on the remainder of your quantum pilgrimage. Remember, the under quantum charts have lessons, other lessons to teach. Our curiosity goes with you on your journey. You walk in the footsteps of those who came before you, and your path go guides those who will follow later. Is there anything else for me to do here? I cannot imagine there is. Also, the gravity was way too hard for me to even fucking... <laughs> Enter that. That's fucking funny as shit. Alright. Aha. Uh -huh. I figured it out. Okay, okay, okay. What does the ship log tell me? Okay. There's still one more quantum area that I couldn't go to because I think everything else is complete. I recall to know my stat, uh, stat shuttle from the quantum moon. Can I send it back? There's still the Tower of Quantum Knowledge that I need to try get to, which I still didn't really know how to do. I can go back... This tower, located on Brittle Hollow's equator, held useful knowledge for Nomai embarking on their first pilgrimage to the Quantum Moon. A Nomai named Solanum was told to visit the Tower of Quantum Knowledge uh, on Brittle Hollow's equator to learn one final rule before embarking on her pilgrimage to the Quantum Moon. I think I need to go back there. I went AFK for like a minute and you already finished it. Yeah. I'm gonna focus on the quantum stuff because I I wasn't sure how to get through the, the last quantum area. And I think I think I think I'll be okay now that I have the knowledge I do. I think a lot of it probably had something to do with the the puzzles I was dealing with. Alright. Uh I see Brittle Hollow over there. Let's hope autopilot doesn't fuck me over too much here. Yeah. I also see the quantum moon, so that's fun. Unless I can land on it just by, like, having a scout. Seeing it. That would be interesting. Let's try that. It seems very unlikely I can do that, but I'm kind of tempted. No, you know what? We're heading to Brita Hollow. Oh, I, I didn't even fucking abort the, the fucking... That's funny. I forgot to fucking abort the autopilot. Uh, that's not good. Okay, retro rockets, please. Oh god. That's funny. Anyway, equator, equator, equator. Where's the tower? Where are we looking? This is the tower, isn't it? Yes. That was really fucking bad. Holy shit. What a landing. The trees are moving, the trees in this grove wander freely, yeah, 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 okay. So I wonder if I can land on this rock. Now this one just moves around here.
Okay. I can't take also whoa. Alright, well we're here. Let's go in. I love how the gravity gets, like, deeper the closer you go to... Gravity gets, like, stronger the, the closer you get to the, the black hole. It's creepy as shit. Okay. Now this is where I got stuck last time. And I wasn't sure what to do. Send these stairs. The issue is I don't know how to ascend these. I so badly want to give you a hint, but you, yeah, 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 no, I don't, don't give me a hint. Hello? Oh, that was, that was just a rock falling. the scariest shit. <sighs> yeah, I really don't know. This is where I got stuck last time, so I really don't... Um... Perspective so fucking weird. Just trying to think of the the quantum mechanics that I've been dealing with.
Fuck, I got no clue, dude. Maybe it's this? Probably just to get out. It's like my only guess out. I'm gonna run out of oxygen before I get there, by the way. This could work is the sad part. It's not going to, but like it could. No. There's me the dev said so too, yeah. I'm guessing, actually, maybe there's something I need to observe. Gotcha, yeah, okay. Is the black hole just swallowing things up at the bottom there? No hints, yeah, no hints. I need to figure this out. You know, it's awfully kind of the Nomite to leave like very easy ways to get back to where we were. Not that it matters. I think I'm going to reset the loop very soon. Oh, we're almost at Brittle Hollow. Why is my ship out here? Oh, that's why. <laughs> no wonder it's here. I bet I arrived earlier than the planned time too. Yeah, okay. That was the most, I think, anticlimactic death I've had. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> okay, if you say so. Let's head back. I'm surprised that killed me too. I think my vitals were already a little low, so... Fair enough, I guess. Where is the Brittle Hollow? There it is. That's not... Okay. Uh... <laughs> we got a fucking orbital boost, speed boost. They do that with satellites in the real world. It's it's funny. A 
Have I been to this one? I think I've already done this. Anyway. That's the cannon. I'm looking for not the cannon, but... Okay, we are on the equator, so that's good. Can I get closer to the planet? That'd be great. And not... And also maybe not kill myself doing so, but... Here it is. Found it. I really want to solve this. Wait, can I... Aha. Uh -huh. What moved? Why did that move? Am I moving that? I don't know. Did I check this? Yes, I have. I reckon it has something to do with shooting your scout in first. But I don't know what it, I'm supposed to do. Clearly it's telling me to go up and down with this. But I don't know what I'm supposed to be observing. Uh, that's not very good. No, uh, you know what? It's fine. This is fine. I see. Hey Benton, welcome. Ah. Uh... <laughs> I I I imagine it has something to do with observing something before I'm supposed to. I just really don't know what it's meant to be. Hello. What's with the, the shadow of the thing? Oh, this is like telling us where the, the eye of the universe is. One of well, the eye is related to like... 
Dude, I don't know. I don't know what to do here. Maybe I shoot my scout on here. Do I know you, Benton, by the way? Just, or are you just joining for the first time? Because there is a friend I have on Discord that I sent, but I don't know if they've come to the um, stream or not. Uh, I would also prefer if you don't put any links in chat for whatever reason. Um... Because I think they'll be deleted automatically, but... If you want to give it a shot, maybe just send the, the end of the Discord invite link rather than the full thing um oh god fuck what do you want me to do i can't think of anything else that i haven't already done that i can Maybe it does quite literally have to do with the fucking... I'm gonna run out of o oxygen and I really don't know what to do here. I think down here is a dead end, so I might want to go up. Interesting... Oh, 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 hello, hello. There's something I can stand on here. Ooh, you, you know what it could be? Also, I'm out of oxygen.
Come back another time. Okay, actually, I don't know if you should answer this, but I'm gonna ask uh, an actual question and not rhetorical to myself this time. Is this something I can solve with the tools I have at my disposal right now? I think I did have a brainwave, by the way. <laughs> yes, okay. Um, I think I did have a brainwave, just for the record. I think I know exactly what they want me to do. I think I just noticed, um, as I died. Um... <laughs> Always makes sense. I just lack knowledge. Uh, that's not gonna work. That's not gonna fucking work. We're gonna fucking crash and die and burn. <laughs> Alright. Let's get out of the atmosphere first. No. I found this ship. Anyway, uh, this is the equator. So, okay. Let's slow down, please. But I'm gonna come back because I'm pretty sure. Now I'm I'm I might be uh, mistaken here, but I'm pretty sure that what I'm looking for right here. is this. This window, once it's observed, I have a feeling I'll be able to go through it. Because it looks hollow through here. But when I'm observing it from directly, when I observe it directly, I'm not sure I can actually enter. I think there's a reason why there's all these windows telling me that I should send a scout through them. It's hard to say for certain, but I'm pretty sure it's this. And there is this area I can land on. No? Doesn't look like it. Oh god, okay. My brainwave is that these windows look fucking transparent through the, the scout, so I if I observe it with the scout I should be able to get in, but maybe not. But it's clear they want me to go up and down, that's the thing. At least to me, I look at this and go, well, there's like five, there's like a place to stand here. My only other thought is that I can just fly up here, but I don't think that's it. Ow.
you need me to post the, the link? I did see it early and it wasn't deleted. Hold up. Hopefully that actually doesn't get deleted because I'm someone who's has access to it. Can you? It, at the very least, you can see it on stream chat. I don't know if you can see it in chat. There we go. You're putting into Google- No, you go to the add server, the, the plus button at the bottom of Discord and join server and copy that code into it. <laughs> what do you mean you're putting it into Google? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm just watching this like, damn, what the fuck? I'm wondering if this actually functions like a teleport. Because I'm seeing this, and I'm seeing this over the Ash Twins. And now it's over Brutal Hollow. And now it's moved over to the Eye. Incredibly dumb as fuck, yeah. This is falling at some point into the, the, the abyss. I really don't know. looking at what is that oh that's giant steep <laughs> oh because it's the back side it's dark side okay no wonder I had no clue what it is also that's the interloper we're gonna die we're gonna run out of oxygen here why am I running low on oxygen oh no that's just the time Wait. Is this something I can travel to after it gets thrown through Brittle Hollow? It must be. Is this the fucking tower? Oh, I wonder if the tower gets sent here at some point. Also, I'm gonna crash into this. Maybe I have to come here once the tower gets sent here. Also, this is bullshit. This shit should be...
Interesting. Interesting. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I wonder if I need to wait for shit to go through the black hole and explore shit there. I don't think the tower itself will go through the black hole, but I did get sent through the black hole at some point while I was standing in the tower. I need to check. How did that happen? I'm checking my VOD, actually. Oh, it does go through the back hole. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I think I'm supposed to wait for it to go through the black hole. And that's at the end of the cycle. Because that's when there's no... Hmm. I only just noticed that when things go through the black hole, they actually show up on the other end. Which, fucking, of course, that makes sense. But... Hmm. Hmm, that's interesting. Oh, that's really interesting. Now the question is, do I wait it out? Because I'm looking at the... the... If I look at my VOD... How far into the plot were we? Like, it's really red. The sun. I just assumed I fell into the black hole, but no, it might be that the entire tower fell. I just wonder if I'm overthinking it. Check your ship log? Sure. I don't know if there's anything for me to do on Hollow's Lantern either. It just seems like a hostile moon.
Uh, here we go. So, like, I'm trying to figure out the quantum tower of knowledge. That's the lo what I've been trying to work at. But there's a lot of stuff I've started without, you know... Oh, I see what you mean. I see what you mean to get there. Oh, I gotcha. Oh, wait, I meant to I meant to send a scout to the anglerfish. The dead anglerfish, the skeleton. And then I go from the stepping stone cave and then I follow the light. Okay. That makes more sense. I am what I am kind of cautious of the time because it's getting pretty late. Um I reckon we have time for one more loop. I really want to try this quantum thing. I reckon that's dangerously close. I'm gonna fly straight into the sun this way. Okay, that's fine. Let's, like, avoid that. That'd be great. I've been a lot of places, but it doesn't feel like my work's getting any less. The fuck is going on with this angle? This feels so weird. Why am I... Okay. I think I may have fucked up in terms of... Um... Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. No, that's fine. Sure. I may have left this too long. Uh, fucking the headlights are damaged. That's why it's so dark. But let's try get inside. There's a fucking thing. I see. Okay. The problem is I want to investigate this, but I also got a... This is for the oxygen, isn't it? So where am I going? Have I even been this way? Must be this way. I'm flanking. I think it is this way. Yeah, okay. Found it. I know where I am.
fucked up that I feel safe in this city. No, I don't, because the sand's gonna fucking destroy me. But like, once I arrive, I'm like, oh, we're good. Anyway. Stepping stone destroyed. Okay. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Well that certainly wasn't fucking good. Give me some oxygen back, please. What did I fucking poke myself on? Okay. And you find the stepping stone cave. Is that it? I think this is. Physics, please. Yeah, okay. I get the feeling I was meant to send it down further. Oh wait, no, I see the scout. Oh, is it up here? Ah, I found it. Okay. Yeah, no, I gotcha. You know what? That works. I'm not complaining. I made it in anyway. <laughs> whoever it was when we... Uh, whoever it was... Uh... Sorry, whoever was it wh when we ended last time? Hang on. Whoever was it when we ended last time is the anglerfish. <laughs> Rule change. The ang oh, I see. This is their playing. Rule change is it. I see. Whoever was it when we ended last time is the anglerfish. I think they probably should have italicized it there. I was a bit confused. Rule change. The anglefish now has to wear a blindfold and do not peek. Why are we changing it? It's so hard if you can't see anything. And Pi, Aunt Pei, Pi says real anglefish are blind. So you have to wear a blindfold. The rule stands. Rule update. It's okay if young kids don't wear the blindfold when they're at it. The rest of us will wear it for scientific accuracy and make the game more even. The rest of us, the little fish, line up against one wall. When the anglerfish says go, the little fish sneak across to the other side. The anglerfish catches you, you're eaten. Last little fish to be caught is the new anglerfish. The old anglerfish gives the new anglerfish the blindfold, becomes a little fish. I cannot imagine what the fuck it was expecting me to do there. But okay. There's also something up here that I definitely want to see if I can reach. Anglerfish study. Wow. Okay. <laughs> this anglerfish dish's digestive tracts suggest death by starv by starvation. An update. Melloray. While I was making sketches of the anglerfish, I observed the children I saw earlier playing here again. They've added a rule to the game that it incorporates our research. It's wonderful. I'm entirely delighted. It's never too early to appreciate biology. The long growth protruding from its head is bioluminescent. Perhaps it used this growth to attract a prey, to attract prey, a lure. Visually, the specimen appears to be of the same species as anglerfish and dark bramble. We don't believe it originated from this planet. Is this taking me back to this area? I feel like I've found this exit before. I don't think there's anything else for me here.
Take me back here. That's fascinating. Okay. I think that's it. I will check the ship log because I'm close enough to do so. And I also I really need fuel. What's the fucking Oh, right, the deeps it's because it's right next to us. Anglerfish fossil seems to be done. Okay, cool. Uh, line up again. When the angle of dead go, the little fish, the blind. Okay, so that was the research. So one player was the angle of fish and wore a blindfold. The angle of fish wore a blindfold, so the angle of fish can't see. The rest of the children, the little fish, lined up against one wall. When the angle of fish said go, the little fish had to sneak across to the other side. The blindfold rule was added because a real anglerfish are blind. <laughs> okay, that only just tells me that they're blind. Okay, one of the Nomai escape pods never made it out of Dark Bramble. I see, so that must be related. Vessel somewhere in Dark Bramble. I see. <laughs> okay. I think I'm done here for now, because this one says I need to go to Dark Bramble. I don't think there's anything else for me to do, actually, on on uh, Ember Twin. At least for the time being, it seems like this was mostly a place to find information anyway. But yeah, I think I'm done with Ember Twin. Can we not? Can we not? Can we fucking not? There's some more fucking that needs to be repaired. Off the planet we go. Um, and ideally, I actually want to head to the black hole now. That is Timber Hearth. That's not helpful. Where the hell are we going? Brutal Hollow. Great. Back to the tower now that time has passed. It's still not enough time for it to have gone through the black hole. That's the thing. The sun was really red when I saw it. Anyway, we're lucky we're... That's not the tower, is it? Is it? Oh, it is. Like it's quite literally inside. I think I need to wait for this tower to fall through to the black hole. But, I don't know how long that's going to take. Is there anything else I can take a look at? I still need to figure out, I also need to figure out where the fuck... I went to the black hole forge. I'm pretty sure that's where I was sent to. Uh, from the Ash Twin. Statue Island. I think the next thing I could do is properly explore the Giant's Deep at some point. Because I haven't really done that. <laughs> I 
but I'll, I'll leave that for next stream. The problem with going down now is that I won't have... Sun's getting redder. I think the orbital... The sun station's been consumed. The interesting with the sun... The interesting thing with the sun station is I have to get there before... Um... A certain moment. Before it gets consumed, but I don't think the... The the sand on the um, Ash Twin has been sufficiently, you know, sucked up. Yeah. See, these are all falling. And I suspect this one is going to be no different. It's just a matter of figuring out how to get to here. Once it falls. Okay. Oh, is that an achievement? <laughs> Are you fucking serious? We're gonna fall at some point. I can't tell you when. But this platform does fall into the, the, the black hole. And that's what I'm waiting for. As long as it doesn't kill me. Trees detected. That's what I was looking for. Are we falling? Not us. But the platform next to us. Okay. I don't want to stand at the top because I'm afraid it's going to be one of those asteroids that hits us from the moon. But we are going to fall at some point. I just need oxygen, because I don't want to run out of that. He's about to fucking... Where the fuck is my scout? What the fuck? Where did I leave my scout? Oh, it's on fucking... It's under the sand, that's why. Are we moving? What's the next platform? It's possible that the what I had was just the effect of the black hole getting bigger as well. Rather than this platform falling. It's hard to tell when I it's really hard to tell since I was so low down. I'm waiting for this planet to collapse. That's kind of morbid. When you think about it, right? If the sun music starts playing, that's not, that's whatever, right?
giant steep. Okay. It'll be whole again later. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> anyway, I know I have to get to the Hanging City from here as well. It's not too far, hey. The sun is boiling hot, and I'm shocked we haven't been absorbed by the black hole just yet. Unless this is literally just a matter of I was black hole got too big and that's how it got absorbed are we falling I think we're falling yep we're falling let's go this is what I'm looking for and holy shit where am I there it is there it is let's go I found ya. Okay. This is what I needed. Problem now is with getting there. Ship hull breach? What does that mean? Anyway, I think I figured this out, yeah. Okay. This is what I'm supposed to do. I need to be quick about this as well. Okay. I found this. I don't see a dis place to display it though. First of all, let's do this. Okay, time stopping. Good. <laughs> okay, welcome, Solanum. Your arrival here means you've completed your preparations on Giant Deep and you're ready to part for the Quantum Moon. Just on your on your pilgrimage, the quantum moon will carry you, just as it carried me and many in our clan before me, to the moon's sixth and most secret location. You'll be aided in your pilgrimage by the shrine our clan built on the quantum moon. But remember, this is for the final rule. To explore the sixth location, the shrine must be on the moon's north pole. Be cautious on your journey. Okay. I need to pop this in. If you're here to make your first pilgrimage to the Contra Moon, you're all, you are almost prepared to set uh, out on this deeply significant journey. Before you do, pause and remember your history. Uh, we make this journey not only for ourselves, but also to honour the members of our clan who came before us. Those who, who after the crash, uh, <laughs> that brought them to the star, after the crash that brought them to the star system, became stranded on Brittle Hollow and Ember tw in between, with no communication between those two groups of survivors. These Nomai looked upward from two different planets and saw the same wandering moon whistling their skies. If this moon, the quantum moon, it was this moon, the quantum moon, that kept their curiosity alive during this long period of, uh, of hardship. Uh, after the two divided groups were able to reunite, and uh, it became our clan's united goal, goal to visit the quantum moon. This took time, and many Nomai who dreamed of seeing the quantum moon died before we discovered how to make the journey. Um, and then, last one. When you reach quantum moon, recall these Nomai and carry a curiosity with you. Okay. Great. That's not what I'm looking for at the moment, though. I'm looking for... The projection stone. I'm looking for a projection stone. Where the fuck is a projection stone? I don't have time. I don't have time. There are no projection stones.
Unless it's literally like right here and I'm blind as shit. Um. I don't see any projection stones. I'm gonna have to come back. There's absolutely something I'm missing here. Unless that is it. Maybe that is it. Is that the quantum moon telling me where it is, actually? It probably is around Brittle Hollow, then. No. It's moved to the, the star of the universe. That's interesting. Anyway, hi, um... Yep. Yeah. It's okay, you've done well. Okay. That's fascinating, actually, hey. Well, I'll take a look. I'll take a look at the log before we stop. We're, yeah, we're good. Six look. Oh, I see. Okay. After the true groups of Mergra. Okay. After the pilgrimage of Quantum Moon was a deeply significant journey for the Mo Nomai. After the two groups of Nomai stranded on Ember Twin and Brutal Hollow were reunited, it became the United Goal to visit the Quantum Moon. And now we're getting close. Quantum Shrine. The Nomai built a shrine on Quantum Moon in aid to aid the pilgrimage in its sixth location, to its sixth location. Many Nomai went on a pilgrimage during which the quantum moon carried them to its sixth and most secret location. To explore the sixth location, the shrine of the quantum moon must be the moon on the moon's north pole. What does that mean? The shrine must be on the moon, moon's north pole. The shrine, the shrine. The shrine of the eye? Okay, hold on. The Nomai built a shrine on the quantum moon to, in, to aid the pill in its in the pilgrimage to its sixth location. Remember this final rule to explore. I'm gonna actually look at everything. <laughs> After the two groups of Nomai stranded on Ember Twin and Brittle Hollow you reunited, reunited, it was the united goal to find and visit the quantum moon. Is this the shrine that they're talking about? A huge cylindrical structure that generates this... This is a gravity cannon, yeah, but... This is on Brittle Hollow, isn't it? Yeah. I recall to know my shuttle from the quantum moon. This tower held knowledge, and Nomai needed to make his or first, her first quantum journey. Observing a quantum object, observing an image of a quantum object, these are the same. 
The Nomai called this the rule of quantum imaging. Remember the quantum shards. Other quantum shards have other lessons to teach. Well, okay. That's these. There's a strange rock shard in this grove that moves when I'm not watching. It emits a signal. Okay. I found a poem written in one of the... What was the poem again? Did I take a screenshot of this? Please tell me I took a screenshot of this. I must not have, but I can check my 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 stream vods. Cause I know I did that last stream. The gnome I notice a strange wandering about up here. Okay, yeah, this is just the need to be in darkness. I reckon I need to go to the gravity cannon. But it has something to the do with being able to see it. Okay, okay. I feel like I have enough information to figure out what to do, but I'm not quite there. Like, I'm not figuring it out. Uh, tonight at least. I'll have a think about it. Thank you so much for watching, because I'm done for tonight. <gasps> oh, I'm glad I figured that out. That took so long. I can just send the invite link to Curb. I probably won't join the server. But yeah, um... Holy shit, thanks for watching. I'm going to bed. Good night. Jump off the landing platform. Sure. Wait. Oh, damn, I had my fucking suit on. Okay. Well, can't do much about that, unfortunately. Okay, that kind of hurt, though. Um. Yeah. Thanks for watching. We'll get some nice music in a moment. Good night, Lorex. Hi. Have you been lurking or did you just arrive? Want some nice music? Yeah, here we go. See you next time on, uh, yeah, I'll see you on next Outer Wilds. Good night.